today we're going to focus on um, sort of connecting with, with our members and uh, creating environments that, that they may look to, to work in. They work in the goal people. Uh, they're not always going to have access to um, you know, huge areas and lots of equipment and everything else. Um, so we're just going to share um, some exercises with them that they can um, take away and use and utilise with the golf clubs that they work with. Okay? So we're going to focus on activation and that will in include connection between us. Uh, we're going to look at um, a variety of different warm-ups and that will be some with the ball, some without the ball. It might be one keeper working, might be two, might be three. So um, lots of variety in, in that sense. trying to create here boys okay again this might be the first time I work with you so I'm trying to create an enjoyable fun environment for you you can say it's been that up to now yeah loads, loads of fun and enjoyment is it changing a little bit different a little bit diverse and that's what you want you want excitement when you come to work as a goalkeeper Great activation exercise. I'm breathing, the lads are breathing. Lots of multi movements, okay, in all different directions. Loads of touches of the ball, obviously, with the football, the basketball. Big loping movements instead of short, sharp movements. It could be the hand position. It could also then be just about the handling technique. So you can still use that as a technical practice. We're using it as a warm up, but you could spend as much time on you want, as you want on that, dealing with the technical aspects. And that's just that simple practice. I mean, the key thing is, the good thing is that we're getting the goalkeeper work, working multifunctionally, so they're using both feet to play out, and I think that's very important. So it might be just a short, sharp pass in the middle. It might be a longer, uh, more accurate pass required from the outside when you're working that longer distance. 